This is Sean, a.k.a. The Creeper. Hit Parade Big Box 21 Galactic Edition Series 1, 18 out of 50. Millions of pesos? I don't think that's worth what you think it's worth. Well, I would say this one, uh, you could argue there's a theme here. First Order Stormtrooper. How about a 1977 original Kenner Star Wars Stormtrooper 75? BT Dub, the, the Stormtroopers are a big get, especially the originals. And if you're wondering what my pause was, I was trying to not touch it and look at an angle to see if it's the OG. And it is the OG. Twenty seventeen top Star Wars Ian White Journey to the Last Jedi. Uh, it is an autograph in the guise of a sticker. Ian White. They uh, mocked it up to look like one of the old school stickers, but it is a card. And Tales of the Jedi 2, it's a 9.6 from 93. I'm going to throw your uh, free gift in there, too, that came with your order. Forty four out of fifty. bobblehead Supreme Leader Snoke from 1977 good old Ben Kenobi with light gray hair Nick Kellington as Bistan from Rogue One Autographs. A 
and Star Wars Dark Empire 2, number one. It's a 9-2 from 94. Return of Emperor Palpatine. One out of ooh, this one's heavy. Forty one out of fifty. Uh, you know, Belinda, it's possible. <laughs> Bib Fortuna. Actress Carrie Fisher from The Empire Strikes Back, Extra Mint 6. Oh, Jordan, I was born lucky. And as a reminder, when I was 19, I got one tattooed on my chest. Gungan Warrior. That is a 9.0. Pretty cool. Take that. And 9.4 Star Wars Tales of the Jedi number five. It's from 94. for Le Piste de Resistance. Uh, the Flawless Basketball Jordan is not first off the line. Hit Parade Big Box Comic Edition Series 1, 29 out of 50. I did. I really enjoyed my day off yesterday. I feel like I got to recharge the batteries and come back with some heat today. Wasp and Ant-Man, as well as Goliath. I was going to say another word, but I think the more accurate word is a trio of superheroes. Uncanny X-Force numero uno. It's a 9.8 signed by the J. Scott. 
Scott Campbell. And yes, that's his variant cover. 9-8 from 2010. Oh, that is a hit. You also got a pack of Ant-Man and the Wasp. By the way, that is one of my go-to uh, little inexpensive boxes to pull really great items out of. You can get those usually for less than a hundo or right around a hundo. Uh, Kelly, call them. Call their customer service number. You got to Google it. Emails, you might as well bang your head against the wall. They're not going to answer them. Oh, hey, Ken Lashley. How are you doing? I love your use of negative space. Hi, Jordan. Girls, number two, November of 02, page six, featuring Poison Ivy. I'm going to say Catwoman. And some nuts. I like that last panel. Uh, that is done by Jay Bone. Yeah, Sean. Um, what are what are another words for walnuts? Seeds, right? Seeds, walnuts, same thing. Just depends if you're talking about dicots or monocots. Coniferous or deciduous. I could go all day. These boxes, and I've said it before, if I was not buying a house and have to have every single dollar extra put into my down payment, I would personally buy a couple of these boxes. Probably two. To be honest, I'd probably buy two for myself. And, and you know, the next iteration, if it is...